Welcome to our math challenge problems. Let us answer this problem. A point E is chosen at random from within square A, B, C, D, expressed as a decimal to the nearest hundred, the probability that triangle A, B, D is of choose. Okay, before we give the answer, do not forget to please subscribe for more math challenge problems and math contest drills for Filipino kids videos. Okay, let us answer this problem. A point E is chosen at random from within square ABCD, expressed as a decimal to the nearest hundred, the probability that triangle ABE is obtuse. So let us start by drawing our figure, square ABCD, and we will try to figure out what kind of triangle will be formed when E is placed inside the square. So to approach our problem, we will divide the square into three sets using a semicircle, thereby dividing the interior of the square into three sets or three regions that is inside the square but outside the semicircle. Second set is the set of points on the semicircle. And the third set will be the set of points interior to the semicircle. So Case 1, if E is inside the square but outside the semicircle with AB as the diameter, triangle ABE will be acute. Did you figure it out? Case 2, what if point E is placed on the semicircle? If E lies on the semicircle that has AB as its diameter, then triangle ABE will be a right triangle. Since in geometry we have a theorem saying that an angle inscribed in a semicircle is a right angle. So in this case, triangle ABE will be a right triangle. The third case is that point E is placed not on the semicircle but interior to the semicircle. So in that case, the triangle ABE that will be formed will be obtuse. So any point inside the semicircle point E forming triangle ABE will be an obtuse triangle with E as the obtuse angle. Okay. So if we continue to answer this problem solving for the probability we now consider the area inside the semicircle and the area inside the square smaller area over the bigger area. Our equation will be P is equal to the area of the semicircle over the area of the square. If R is the radius of the semicircle, then 1 half pi R squared is the area. Over the bigger area, that is the square, since the side of the square is the diameter of the semicircle, then the side of the square is 2R. That area will be 2R squared. Simplifying this expression, we'll have pi over 8. And we are asked to express this answer in decimal to the, to the nearest 100. So the probability is 0 0.39.